श्री राम नाम सत्य है ये सत्य है सत्य मीन द ट्रूथ बट यू लिखना इन फ्रंट ऑफ अस ये इज अ ट्रूथ ऑफ लाइफ हाउ मेनी यू रेडी फॉर दिस थिंग इट विल कम एनी मोमेंट एंड द गोल इज इन अ पैंडेमिक एनी मोमेंट दिस कैन स्ट्राइक आर वी रेडी फॉर दैट शुड वी बी रेडी फॉर दैट गुड क्वेश्चन So maybe you understand. I'm sorry, you don't have a PA system where I can probably reach everybody. But this guy is deep in this thing, so he needs to hear my voice clearly. But somebody outside there is listening to this thing and also watching at the same time. So if you can stay as quiet as you can, he can do a good job. Put our hands together, my dear friends. 
Today we have all gathered to pay a final tribute, farewell to one who was with us, stayed with us in so many ways as a mom, as a citizen of our land, as a, as a sister probably. She was a wife as also in this uh, land of ours. And of course, it's only fitting for us to send her back in a most uh, honored and civilized fashion. We ask of God to take care of her. Bow our heads in prayer. Hari Om Shantakaram Bhujagashainam Padmanabham Suresham Veshwadharam Gaganesadresham Meghavaranam Shubhangam Lakshmi Kantam Kamalanainam Yogi Virdhyanagamyam Bande Vishnu Bhavabhayaharam Sarvalokai Kanatham Om Vishnavi Namaha Om Vishnavi Namaha Om Vishnavi Namaha Ram Nam Satya Hai Sabka Yehi Gata Hai So the flowers are to be Please be seated my dear friend Yeah. Snanam Mayadi Adi Dao Pratishtitam 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 Prat
नाम मया दिए तौ प्रतिष्ठिता चंदन मया दिए तौ प्रतिष्ठिता कश्यप गोत्र से चमनी प्रीत से मृत स्थान शब्द नाम निमित गंधम मया दिये तो प्रतिष्ठिता ओम गंधम मया दिये तो प्रतिष्ठिता अध्य कश्यप गोत्र से मृत स्थान शब्द नाम निमित चमनी गंधम गंधम मया दिये तो प्रतिष्ठिता कश्यप गोत्र से चमनी प्रीत से गोहर मृत स्थान शब्द नाम निमित पुष्प मार मया दिये तो प्रतिष्ठिता गोत्र चमनी प्रेत मृतस्थानिमित गंधम मया दिये तौ प्रतिष्ठिता यम द्वारे महाघोरे अंधेन तम साधि तत्कमर्थाय दीपो यम उपतिष्ठिता अध्य कश्यप गोत्र से चमनी प्रेत से मृतस्थान शुभ नाम में दीपम दीपम मया दीयते तो प्रतिष्ठिता कश्यप गोत्र चमनी प्रेत समृत स्थान शब्द नाम निमित ईशते बिंदु मया दीयते तौ प्रतिष्ठिता तिलांजलि मया दीयते तौ प्रतिष्ठिता Right. So now, what I just invite the very immediate family, right? For your son, grandson, daughter, grandchildren will come and put a flower and make a little artifact. Anyone want to come? Just the come very immediate. Brother, sister, cousin, you want to put flowers? Just put a flower. महा Ya 
Gangari Mahaguri and Dina Tamasaki. She died. That's the room of her child. She went down. She came from the city. She went to the city. She went to the city. जंगारी महाबुरे अंधेरा समसाद के प्रतिरूप का मर्दाया जीपोयम प्रतिष्ठिताम Oh, uh-huh. 
सब कुछ कर दे विश्व को भी अमर कर दे पूरा कर दे सब की आशा पूरा कर दे सब की आशा जो भी तेरा ध्यान
That's God's law. Have nothing to do whether you are Hindu or whatever faith you belong to. That's God's law. Even you're working for the government service, whatever position that you hold, you will not hold it for all the time. That also will come to an end too. Is that right? Yeah. And you recognize that? So, this is the life that you're going to deal with. So what is really important? Between the birth and between the death of a person, I call it between the B and the D, that is where the life is. That is where your life is. That is where your journey of life is, between birth and death. And that journey of life, lots of investment should take place. Investment in goodness of life. When you are born under a good parentage, good mommy and a good daddy, and you're born under a good country, you better cherish it. Because you're not too sure whether you're going to get back that in the next round of your life. If you want goodness, you must execute, give out goodness tremendously for you to come back. That's the second law of God. To every action, there is an equal and opposite reaction. So if you want something good for you, you better give out something that is the best. It will return to you. Like I said, Nara will continue to move on to the next destination. Where would she go, really? Where would she go? Herself and the God will decide that. It's like the child who comes in front of the teacher. The child who comes in front of the teacher and says, Miss or Sir, could you put me in an A class in the next term? What should the, the, the teacher do? Just check the grade. Check the grade. Check the grade. So you have to show performance before I can move you to the next level. Same thing with that. Same thing with that. Your, your movement to the next spot depends on your performance, the past performance. What have you done? What have you conquered? How much love have you shown to your family, to your husband, your wife, your children, your neighbors? How much love have you shown toward the next destination? So this is really not a free life. We just think so. Because there's nobody watching us. Sometimes we feel we, we, we are the boss of everything. We can do what we want. But there is somebody taking notes. Somebody is noting your life. And at the moment of death, that is marked out. So, this life of ours is given to us by God himself. One of the very important uh, transactions that we need to do in our lives is to learn to love the Lord. Learn to love God through the hearts of your mother, through the hearts of your dad, through the hearts of your husband, through the hearts of your children, through the hearts of the plants and the animals and the country that you find yourself in. If you can do that, you're good. You don't need a priest to come next to you and to tell you where you'd go the next dimension. We call that performance. Those who perform well will arrive in a better destination. That which came out of the body, we all call it the Atma or the soul. The body, it will be disintegrated by fire, but the Atma cannot be disintegrated. I don't know how God make it like that. No fire. No water, no weapon, no kind of instrument can bring it to an end. It is part of the maker, it goes back to the maker. Wherever he decides to put you, he is the one, he is the judge. We are always being judged in our lives. And we know that. Our mother will judge us, our father will judge us, our children will judge us, the neighbor will judge us, the government will judge you, your friends will judge you. Could you imagine how... God will judge you. Hmm. Could you imagine that? You think about it as you begin to live your life. And live your life responsibly, with respect, with honor, that God feels pleased with you. And sometimes you just know, you know, matter how you just know when God is pleased with you. Inside your heart, mm -hmm. there is a kind of continued joy mm -hmm. and happiness that you have performed. You feel good yeah. because you have acted rightly all the time. Yes? Yeah. Ram Nam? Yeah. Satya. Satya means the truth. And this thing with image from the body, it looks like a person. You ever see it? You have to be around at the time when she was coming out. Come out from any opening of the body. Now what Dwari Pure Dehi. 
the body is defi defined as there are nine doors in which this thing can come out. There are five upper doors and four lower doors. The greatest door is the one on top of the head. Hmm. You mommy will know when you're bathing your, your little baby. There's a part of this called very thin and beaten like that. Isn't that so? You ever see that? Beaten like that. Thin part, the thinnest part of the skull. And that goes with you until you die. If you have love for God so much, there the soul sometimes come through. I will never return back to planet Earth. Do you want to come back? You decide that. You could do that. You want to come back and be the same old person that you are? The same place, same company, same country? You could decide that. The power is in your hands uh, as a human being. You have been born on this earth to make your life better, to upgrade your life. You notice on the, cell, on the cell phone that you have these days, that every moment the phone is upgrading itself. Is not so? You see that for yourself? Upgrade yourself. Don't live the same life throughout birth and death. You must become better. Most important, you must become educated. You need to go to school and learn well. You need to go to church and learn about your Lord. Whatever the church is. I'm sure the amount of people I see here today is a testimony of the kind of goodness nature that this person is charming. First time I'm seeing her. But your presence here tells me a lot of the kind of person that she was in her life. It tells me also look at the, the sons. She must have done good things to her sons. That the sons come back today to perform the rites of them all. God bless them. God bless them. Ram Nam. Let us praise the Lord. Raghupati Raghava Raja Ram Pati Tapavan Sita Ram Raghupati Raghava Raja Ram Pati Tapavan Sita Ram Sita Ram Sita Ram Bhajuman Pyaare Sita Ram Sita Ram Sita Ram Bhajuman Pyaare Sita Ram Raghupati Raghav Raja Ram Patit Pavan Sita Ram Ishwar Ram Tero Ram Sab Ko San Mat De Bhagwan Ishwar Ram Tero Ram Sab Ko San Prabhupati Raghav Raja Ram Patit Pavan Sita Ram O Patit Pavan Sita Ram O Patit Pavan Sita Ram Ram Nam Satya Satya means the the truth as you live your life, look for the truth. You hear all kinds of things about somebody. You need to decipher what the truth really is. Yes? Come again. So Jenny will give a eulogy. Eulogy is a very important thing in the, at the moment of departure. Sometimes uh, as a matter of fact, this life of ours, we are always learning from somebody else. Either directly from the person, like the guru, the teacher, mommy, daddy, or from books. Books are other people's expressions and ideas. So we're always learning from somebody. And sometimes it's so important to learn from those people who have passed on. We can learn something from their lives that will fix our own lives 
and make us a better person. Now I ask them, Jenny, to read the eulogy. Good morning, everybody. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning. Welcome to the funeral service of our Auntie Shorty. Where do I even begin? Words seem to fall even though there aren't enough words to describe the incredible soul that was our Auntie Shorty. To say she was an amazing wife, mother, sister, aunt, mother-in-law, grandmother, great-grandmother will be a grievous understatement. She was too much to fit into a category. She wasn't just a mother to her own kids, but also to her nieces, nephews, and all who grew up in her presence. From the stories of her own parents, when her mother died, even though she wasn't the oldest, she immediately took up the mother role for her siblings. Working hard alongside their dad from a young age, struggling just to make sure there was always food on the table. Even when she became a mother herself, she relentlessly continued to be hard working. Growing up, she was a tough one. She was a non-nonsense woman, as you will all know, and yet still, because of her aura that surrounded her, we all aggravated to her irag 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 regardless of. You gra gravitated. Everyone knew when you reached by Tanti Shorty, you will always felt welcome, and even though she wasn't a wealthy woman, you were sure to get a plate of food, day or night, a warm welcome, and anything you desire, even her guidance of whatever knowledge she needed to give to you. However, by her, by her was always full, or should I say over full. It was a resting place for all who needed it. Whenever most of her nieces and nephews could attest to that, because most of them temporarily lived by her at home, sometimes, sorry, most of them temporarily lived by her home sometimes in their life. She will be missed by her heartwarming smile and no nonsense de de demeanor, her, com demeanor, her comforting ways, her sage advice, and so much more. I know we will all miss her famous coconut bake for sure, which she always make on fireside. She exemplified what it is to be a strong, kind, selfless, and loving person. We are all so grateful to have had her as part of our journey. I know whenever she is, I know wherever she is, she's watching over us and taking notes to scold us when we meet again one day. May the blessing of her good life live followed to get to her into heaven. Her footsteps can never be filled, nor her love ever forgotten. As we bid farewell to our beloved auntie, let each of us hold on to the journey of our joy, love, care, and kindness that she showed. Thank you. Thank you very much. Ram Nam, such a nice idea you have it, my dear friends. Uh, the character and the nature of Nella Shamini, as we, as we call her. So, she was no ordinary mother from what we have just heard. And of course, she will attest to that too as well. And I spoke about a while ago being educated. She was truly an educated mother. When you have love for people, you're fully educated. You understand their needs and their nature. These people are very rare in today's world. This, this is 2021 now. 
to get people like these very rare in the world. She came through many challenging times and passed through the fire of challenges. And she can give support. I hope, I hope you people outside there will have learned something about her life. And you can take it into your own life and share it with others. You have come here, part of your life journey is to learn and to share. Isn't that so? Can't take it to your grave and be good and be good to each other you must always be a brother's keeper she was a brother's keeper she looked out for people just like you look out for each other we also look out for you too that should be the world that we should have I don't know what disaster would it take for us to know that COVID has brought a lot of understanding in our life a lot of stuff has changed also and I hope you learn a lot of a changing world. The world continues to change dramatically. But you know what? If the love for God remains firm and strong, you'll always be protected by the Maker. Ram Nam? Satya. Satya. So I want to thank all of you for, for coming here this morning and uh, sharing your time towards the family in particular. This is a wound in the family's life. We would not cure easily. I'm quite sure many of you, the remembrance and the memory of uh, Nella will remain with you from now for quite a long time. But whatever memory that you remember about her, take it as part of your life and develop your life into a better human being as you live until the master is ready for you. Ram now? That's it. So maybe you all start. We put our hands together. Whatever your thoughts for her, direct those thoughts to God. May God fulfill it. I just want to ask you if in any way our mother, Nella, Shamani Chorty as somebody that she is known by. She has done anything to you and you feel you feel very hurt about it. In one way or the other, I ask you to forgive her. Forgive her. Don't hold a person in your heart, especially at the time when you have to move on with your life. Forgive and what's the next word? Forget. Forget. Forgive and forget completely. And of course if anyone you have done anything to her. In any way, I ask her, through God, to forgive you too. That should be the world you should be living in. Ram Nam, bow our heads in prayer. Whatever your wishes, direct it to God. O Divine Father, you alone, our mother, our father, our helper, our master in every Lord. You are the protector of those who have no support, O Lord. You are always in every way the giver of happiness. You are the destroyer of pain and vices. You are the protector of the entire world, Lord. You possess so much compassion in your heart. Sometimes uh, we forget you, Lord, but you have, we have known that you have not forgotten us in any way. Thank you, Lord, for your kindness. Thank you, Lord, for your support in this life of ours. We pray. Pituma tu saha yakaswami sakha Pituma tu saha yakaswami sakha Tumahi ekhana tahamare ho Jinke kachuare अधार नहीं जिनके कचुआर अधार नहीं जिनके तुम ही रखवारे हो कि तुम तू सहां यक स्वामी सखा तुम ही इबनाम तहमारे हो तुम ही खना
So now we invite other people who have not seen her as yet. Come in one direction, a flower is here. Put a flower and walk out into another direction. Everybody who wants to come to that floor. Ask if any. Ask if any. Ask if any. Yeah. 
No, I don't see her. Don't get married. Put our hands together. Final destination look like in life. All of us went to Pashura at some point in time. So we only here, I've said to you, we're just taking a journey of our lives. The end will come, everything will finish. As we go back to our homes, I, I hope that you, you remember your God. Remember your, your character, your value of who you are. Because this will come to an end. This physical thing comes to an end at some point. She is very lucky that we can do it in a very civilized way. There are many people who have died in the world today, they can't even find them. Through natural disasters, earthquakes and so on, can't find them. But she is here with us, so she is blessed. And she's also blessed to have all of us around her to bid her a wonderful farewell. Mika. Whatever you wish is, let us pray. Hariyo Yang Brahma Badure Tunvanti Tibes Tibair Virai Sang Gayantiyam Sam Gaha Jhana Vastir Tarkati Yogino Yashyantam Navidu Sura Surgana Devaya Tasme Namaha Anadini Dhano Deva Shanka Chakra Nikaksha Preda Muksha Pradu Bhava Preda Muksha Pradu Bhava Ram Nam Satyai Sabka Yedigar